this is going to look really, really bad at first. <laughs> We got it. Oof, it's not bright. We're gonna cut a little drywall and uh, get started on rerouting some uh, wire for some lights. We are finally starting the bathroom. I know a lot of you guys have been waiting for us to get to this point of the build, and it's finally here. The bathroom is up to date to where all we need to do is do all the finishes, the yes. electrical, the you know the paint or the tile, all of that kind of stuff. And if you're wondering why we're not working on the kitchen, it's because we can't. We're at a standstill for right now in the kitchen, waiting for appliances, waiting for countertops with the shutdown and everything going on. Those things are just... We ordered the, we ordered the uh, appliances about 10, 11 weeks ago by now. Yeah, long so, time ago. Yeah, And they were it. actually supposed to be here last week. They're obviously not. It's just, it's just a waiting game. So yes. we are waiting patiently and we are just doing what we can until those come in. And when they do come in, we will cheer and squeal with excitement. I know. Heading under the house to pull the wire back up. Are you working hard or hardly working, Chuck? You're my sunshine every morning. Light up every moment. Make my every dream come true. Oh, I can't describe it. Took my tongue and tied it. Sent my heart over the moon. It comes from Imagine all the things that we could see Yeah, don't you know that life's a dance Come take my hand and fly away with me So for the wall sconces on this wall, we're actually going to center up from edge of the skylight to the wall and center the light fixture to center the skylight this way. Over here on this side, we actually have two measurements. We uh, went ahead and centered up from skylight to skylight, which gives us this measurement. It's not going to work out for us. We're not going to use that guy. Um, we actually got this measurement here because we're going to go from skylight to the glass of the shower. We got that center point there. It's actually within a quarter inch of the other side, so it's actually going to work out great. Cool. Good game. See? You would have been a 16th of an inch off. I would have noticed that. The same. Every inch counts, Josh, okay? Remember that. <laughs> That's why you're with me, girl. What are you gonna do? I mean, you asked me to cut it out next, right? Yeah. I think I hope I can do. Yeah, but if I do that, it didn't work. So my next step is obviously I have to cut it out. Oh, that's just because you don't have my skills, Josh, okay? Do it. You have to, you have to do it like this. There, see? How the hell am I all dirty? <laughs> I have no idea. But you can get started on the next one now. Oh, you're going to edit this <laughs> in. <laughs>
Almost there. So I got some fiberglass tape. It's actually mold resistant fiberglass tape. We're gonna go ahead and tape the joints, mud everything, get everything finished up so you don't see any cracks. Then we're gonna go ahead and uh, waterproof the shower. So we got the joints in the shower taped up, mudded, we got the curbed, mudded also, so that's all done. So now we're gonna let it sit, cure for a few hours, and we're gonna go ahead and waterproof the shower. <laughs> What did you get, sweetie? That's oh. more than a dozen to me, right? <laughs> we also have sheep hair all, for, all over us, right? Yeah. Were you petting Millie? Yeah. Who's this behind you? <laughs> <laughs> now that everything is dry, we can go ahead and start waterproofing the shower area. So this is going to look really, really bad at first, but I promise we're not gonna leave it this way. You don't like the green look, do you? <laughs> What you're seeing on the shower walls and the shower floor is basically a waterproofing membrane. It paints on as a green color, a blue color, and then it dries to be this lovely dark green color. There's other brands like Red Garden, they go on red and dry pink, or yes. pink and dry red, right. I don't know. Either pink way, red. once this coat dries, we go back through with a second coat. We're being sure to pay attention to like any of the joints or you know, like around the bottom of the shower floor and whatnot. So we'll put a second coat on and that will dry and then we would be ready to put tile up. Aquamarine is dry on the walls. You can see that it's aquamarine. It is aquamarine. No, it's not. Aqua defense. 
I was thinking that Josh kind of looks like Aquaman, like, you know, like a smaller, less strong version of uh, Aquaman. Like so I got stacked. confused. <laughs> <laughs> all of the aqua defense is dry on the walls so everything is good it's waterproofed all along the walls and the floor of the shower so now Josh being the excellent electrician that he is is going to go ahead and install that uh, track cove lighting sort of yeah, thing. Yes so we're gonna, actually going to have track lights go from this corner right here around the entire bathroom. We're actually going to do that and then we talked about we were going to do it but Aaron jumped back in and wants to do it now. So we have lights going on the walls we're also going to have track lights for cove lighting for the bathroom shower, hit the switch, turn it on, they're actually 12 volt LED lights. The drivers for those lights will actually be in a junction box that's gonna be above the washer and dryer. <laughs> behind an access panel. Yes. Not inside of here. Yes, he was almost right. He, he almost had that correct there. It's actually not going around the entire bathroom. It's just going to be going around this portion of the shower and this back wall over the- uh, And that side wall too, right? Huh? That side wall Yeah, right however, the entire bathroom would indicate that it is doing a full all the way around. It's actually not, because it's not going to be on this wall over here, which is why, you know, I'm the one that's in charge here and I just kind of like give him the directions and- She just mad because she, could, she, couldn't her, she couldn't get her pants off for last night. <laughs> They're stuck. She was a little hot yesterday. <laughs> if he was a little hot, he probably could have gotten them off me, but he's not. <laughs> <laughs> that's pretty good. <laughs> okay. gals let's go josh went over the budget on uh fireworks this year guys so you better check out those shirts at bunker branding <laughs> i'll leave a link below <laughs> We cut our workday short, but it feels good to be making progress on the bathroom and still have time to enjoy the evening with the kids. Not only is West Virginia full of beauty and freedom, but you can buy some of the absolute best fireworks around. We're calling it a night. Thanks, guys. See you next time.